Saracens made their fourth Premiership final in five years as they beat Wasps in a record-breaking semi-final. Owen Farrell kicked 27 points, Chris Wiles scored the fifth semi-final try in eight years and the 11 tries and 90 combined points were all records. Billy Vunipola lasted a half as the England man showed no ill effects as he returned from a hamstring injury. Saris led 23-5 at the break before an eight-try second period which saw Wasps get to within 10 points at one stage. Mark McCall's side will meet champions Exeter, who they beat in the 2016 final and lost to in the semi-finals last season, at Twickenham next Saturday following the Chiefs' victory over Newcastle. Saracens forwards dominated their opponents in the opening period as they caused eight turnovers. The first, from a knock-on by Wasps fly half Danny Cipriani, led to the possession which saw Farrell skip through the visitors' defence before offloading to Alex Lozowski for the second fastest try in Premiership semi-final history after just 94 seconds. A second Saracens try for Nick Iziek was ruled out six minutes later for a knock-on, but Saris only had to wait one more minute to breach Wasps' defence again, Vincent Koch going over after Maro Itoje was held up just short of S. Jimmy Gopeth had a Wasps try ruled out by the television match official after going into touch just before he grounded the ball, but, after two Farrell penalties, Wasps did go over as Willie LaRue ended a flowing move down the right. Wasps were dealt a further blow late in the half as flanker Jack Willis, who received his first England call-up last week, was forced off with a knee injury which could keep him out of this summer's tour of South Africa. It took just three minutes for Saracens to get past Wasps following the restart as Wiles broke the record for Premiership semi-final tries on his final appearance at Allianz Park after his pack set up a great platform for Farrell and Brad Barrett to provide him with the ball. Wasps rallied and should have pulled the try back straight away, but Elliot Daly's effort in the left corner was controversially disallowed after the ball was adjudged to have hit the corner flag before being grounded. However, Jake Cooper Woolley made no mistake shortly after as he blasted over from close range. They further narrowed the gap as Thomas Young went over under the posts after a great set piece move, and they were further boosted as they held up Farrell as he tried to go over to end a pulsating first 10 minutes of the second half. Farrell stretched the lead with two more penalties, but LaRue got his second score after a lovely break from Guy Thompson as Wasps refused to give up. But when Juan Figaro went over from a meter out after a great run by Sean Maitland, and Itoje did likewise seven minutes later to put the hosts 48-26 to 26 ahead, it was game over. Wasps scored again when the impressive Thompson, who now leaves the Leicester, set up Christian Wade's 70th minute try with another excellent run. But it was Saris who had the final say as Ben Spencer's try with seven minutes to go ended a match that will live long in the memory. Let's block ads. Why?